and uh, as with so many things as well with with field service you know there, there is um incremental improvements can have a huge difference whether it's be on bottom line you know uh in in the pnl whether it be in the work life balance whether it be in the customer service aspect aspects like say it's managing that expectation so those are correct even even now with the esg scores you know and and reducing carbon etc um well listen so, it, yeah, it's, it's interesting, interesting it's interesting you mentioned that actually because traditionally our industry has all been about productivity utilization customer mm-hmm. service experience or all, all those things which of course have their values but now we're seeing these additional elements being rolled into the reasons why you would choose a technology like ours. So one being the uh, the, the, the employee incentive to, to have a good work-life balance, and then the other one really being around sustainability, decarbonisation, and you know, lots of people are, are, are talking it but not doing it, and this is a great opportunity for service companies to make a huge difference. Uh, you know, literally, they can we can do a scheduling test which will show them what... We, they would achieve compared to how, how they routed previously themselves and using their current technology and how we would have done it. And almost always we're looking at 30 to 50% reduction in their average travel time. And that's a lot of fuel and, and driving that they're doing, that we, which we could save literally overnight. And uh, it, re- it really helps the, the argument because uh, yeah, planting a sprig of, uh, of a tree is one thing, but this is real. Uh, yeah, those sprigs might just die and become nothing, whereas this is real savings, and uh, it's it's good for our industry, to be honest. Yeah, yeah, and, and, and something I've been talking about a lot is is the sustainable sustainability um, requirements naturally dovetail with everything we've talked about in field service for so long. Like yeah. you know, reducing the cost, we're reducing our carbon. Yeah. Um, just a really quick point on that before we dive in any further. Um, you mentioned companies can look at. Uh, do, do that, that 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 kind of test so you can run the run the numbers. Um, obviously, we'll put all the links etc across all of the different uh, elements around this. But they would head to the FLS website to be able to arrange that kind of thing. Yeah, it's a contact us form, uh, fastly and smart dot uh, com slash en, which is the uh, the English version. Uh, or they can drop me an email directly, jeremy.squire at fastly and smart dot com. I should know it by now. And, uh, and we'll be happy to help. And uh, it doesn't suit everybody, but uh, we'll, we'll listen to listen to your case. We provide a, a test free of charge. It's our our sprat to catch match rule. It's our, uh, our way of proving the next step. And then maybe the next step is we do a trial with you and uh, and prove it. But uh, really, I, I've taken a different route with this business than than others have in 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 field service. And uh, I I like customers to know what they're buying before they buy it. Um, because it means I get no risk. It means that they know what they're, they're getting. And uh, we achieved uh, 9.6 out of 10 again this year for our um, customer ratings, which is around uh, how, how did you rate the technology, the consulting and the support. And it's a whole combination that comes together. And I think the most crucial part of that is that they know what they're buying before they buy it. So there's none of those expectations which uh, of something, you know, it, you know, I can tell you now, it doesn't make toast, yeah? But it does create an awfully good schedule. <laughs> does it make a good latte macchiato? Mm, got a good coffee machine for that if you like to pop round. So uh, if, if I could say, uh, take this opportunity to say thank you, Chris, and thank you to the panel who uh, voted for, for FLS to be the winners. Fantastic. We're really, uh, we're really pleased. And uh, this for me goes to, uh, to, to my team in the UK to the fantastic development team we have uh, in Germany and, and also to our customers who uh, it's, I think it was their accolades that really made it happen. So uh, thank you very much. Hi there, my name is Chris Oldland. I'm the Editor-in-Chief and Founder of Field Service News. I hope you found that short excerpt from one of our in-depth long-form interviews of use. If you did, then why not have a look at an FSM Pro membership? This will give you access to over 70 hours plus of in-depth long-form interviews where you can access the full interview. You also get access to the world's leading resource library dedicated specifically to the field service management sector. Over 130 resources that cover key areas such as digital transformation in field service remote service technology and how that aligns to on-site service delivery, servitization, advanced services, 
All of these key areas and many more, there are key resources so you can learn from your peers and those that are leading the way in how you, the field service world is evolving. There's also the new FSN education platform and we're adding courses there every single month with already a number of masterclass courses that don't just give you knowledge but actually give you the blueprint so you can develop a program within your own organization and see real world value. You could access all of this content for just £450 a month or you can access it on a monthly basis at £45 a month. Head over to fieldservicenews.com, subscribe and find out more.